Today we're going to be doing the classic dish shepherd's pie and we're going to be using Samuel Adams Irish Red. The first thing I'm going to do is put together the potatoes. Um, if you wanted to, you cut up a bunch of potatoes, mash them, and then add a beer. I just went with a two pound box of uh, pre-mashed potatoes because uh, it's and frankly there isn't much of a difference so you just take a big pot, scoop all the mashed potatoes in and you're going to add just one Sam Adams Irish Red. And you're just going to stir that in there. And right now I've added half a bottle. And I'm going to see how that looks. And stir that in. And we're just going to keep it at half a bottle. Gives a bit of the beer flavor of the mashed potatoes um, without making it too soupy. Um, don't use more than the whole beer, otherwise in the process. We're going to take two pounds of meat. I'm using bison. You can use beef, lamb, any kind of meat you want. I prefer bison. And you use one package of shepherd's pie seasoning per pound of meat. So I've used two here. And it's sat overnight. And we're going to throw it right in the pan and we're going to start browning it up. Takes a little bit of effort to get it out. There we go. Now we're just going to start working that. Now that we've uh, browned up the meat real nice, we're going to go to the last step in cooking the beef, bison. We're going to kick the heat up to high, and we're going to slowly pour in two bottles of the Sam Adams Irish Red. There's the first one going in. We're going to let the bison soak that up real good. And we don't want it to cool down or anything. And we're going to add the second bottle. And we'll make it about a bottle and a half. We'll finish off the one. Mmm, delicious. And what we're going to do is we're going to let all the water cook out of it. We're about halfway done with the reduction process right now. It takes a while. We're going to be able to uh, bring it to the last step and bring the whole dish together. Final steps. We're going to put the whole dish together. First thing you do, take a nice ceramic dish like this. Take your meat and layer that on the bottom there. And uh, what I have here is a one pound bag of peas and carrots. I'm going to use, eyeball about half the bag. Put it in when it's already frozen, that way the vegetables stay crisp by the time you take them out of the oven. And remember uh, first to preheat the oven to 350 degrees. And then you mix that up a little bit. So there's not really a layer. And maybe a little more peas and carrots for color. And last step, you take your potatoes and you layer them on top. Mmm. That looks good. Layer there. 
washer, scrape that bowl real nice, get all all the potato we got nice there. And you're gonna throw it in the oven at 350 degrees until the potatoes up top have crisped real nice. Should be about half an hour, 45 minutes. So we took it out after 15 minutes, sprayed a little bit of Pam, and we're gonna put it in for another 15, and that'll brown the top real nice and good. So it's been 40 minutes, and the shepherd's pie is done. serve ourselves up a slice of Sam Adams bread shepherd's pie. Oh my god. Gorgeous. Mm-hmm. <laughs>